With a new race in Malaysia in December, the eight hours of Sepang, the EWC lives now between Europe and Asia, bridging the two continents. We think that the knowledge and the experience of endurance lies in between Japan and Europe. So we have very much pushed and encouraged Japanese teams and European teams to work together to be stronger. So this is the first one who believed in our project was uh, uh, Fuji-san at, uh, at uh, FCC TSR. He's the first one who understood that ma by making an alliance with the European base would get him in a strong position to win the championship. When we were racing in Grand Prix at the beginning of the 90s, I was able to work alone. We just had a small group. But in endurance racing, you just can't do that. You need more people. There are more parameters you have to manage. So that's why I decided to partner up with the Europeans, and it's working really well. I work with Spanish, French, Japanese. Everything going really well, a great combination. As Fuji says, the squad has mixed very well in the FCC TSR Honda France garage and in hospitality, everybody shares their culture. I've been working for seven years now with Fuji-san. We started in Moto3 in the European Championship. I had to help him a lot to understand the European mentality and way of thinking to start with. Uh, it's very different from the Japanese way. In European races, they adapt and they always work hard. In the 24-hour races, it's a much more European kind of event. In the 8-hour races, they have their own style of operating and, uh, yeah, you don't change anything. They work with a lot of different riders and, and, and nationalities, so everyone knows um, how to deal with, with foreigners or, or different cultures. Right. Europeans react immediately if there's a problem with the Japanese, there's always a protocol, so they tend to be slower. But if you follow their method, it's meetings and meetings. Time passes and the problem remains unsolved. So I made Fuji understand that it's important, it's a strength of the Europeans to react quickly. The Japanese bosses, Fuji-san and the others, are really tough on the employees. They're under constant pressure. He's much more demanding than the European boss, but he has understood that he has to be a little bit tactful. Otherwise, the Europeans won't react very well.